now this is a problem based on limits we have to work out the limiting value of this expression and now before we start working out the limiting value of this expression we need to check whether it is indeterminate form or not because if it is not indeterminate form then we need not work it out we just replace the value of x and we get the limiting value but when we when x replace when x approaches to 0 and you know like 2 to the power 0 is 1 so x approaching 0 means this is 1 1 1 all these quantities are 1 so 1 minus 1 is 0 minus 1 plus 1 is 0 1 minus 1 is 0 so numerator approaches 0 as x approaches 0 in denominator as x approaches 0 cos x is 1 and this is 4 root of 4 is 2 2 minus 2 is 0 and sine 0 is 0 so it is 0 by 0 in determinate form it means we need to work out this limit now to work out this limit if we just see the denominator we have sine x and we have this uh, uh, rational function irrational function sorry e 3 plus cos x square root minus 2 so we ir rationalize this irrational part so we multiply with this and divide with this right we multiply and divide so that we can remove the square root sign so when we uh, multiply with plus sign and apply a square minus b square formula equals to a plus b into a minus b this expression sorry this expression becomes this right so this expression becomes this now and then as x approaches 0 this approaches uh, 1 so the this whole part approaches 4 and we can write this 4 outside now we know this is trigonometric function has nothing to do with this exponential part so we can work out this limit independently uh, so we divide by x multiply with x so that limiting value of sin x by x is 1 right and you know cos x minus 1 we multiply divide with x square multiply with x square and this is something which we have already done 1 minus cos x over x square limiting value of this is half either we can do it using formula method or we can apply a hospital's rule derivative of numerator is sin x and that of denominator is 2x so sin x by x approaches 1 so this approaches half so this way denominator we can simplify this approach is minus half this approach is 1 replacing this 1 and this is minus half we get this we get minus 8 outside and and then we have to work out this exponential form now we can factorize this exponential form right how Let's see the numerator part we can take we can take 2 to the power f uh, 5x common from this right we can take 2 to the power 2x common from this and this 2, 2 to the power x minus so basically we are making this 2 to the power x minus 1 factor in this as well as this so that we can take it common right so we take see this we take 2 to the power 5x common to 2x common and we further factorize this using a square minus b square formula so that it becomes 2 to the power x minus 1 2 to the power x plus 1 we take 2 to the, 2 to the power x minus 1 common now this can again be factorized the leftover part is this can again be factorized we can take 3 to the power 3x common and leftover is 2 to the power 2x minus 1 and this is also 2 to the power 2x minus 1 so we can take 2 to the power 2x minus 1 common right so the further factorization of this is like 2 to the power 2x minus 1 left over is 2 to the power 3x minus 1 right and and the the first factor that we uh, took common earlier uh, this approach is 1 similarly we can we have x cube in denominator so 1x we use with this exponential part and remaining 2x uh, 2x terms we use second one with this and third one with this multiply with 2 divide with 2 this approach is 1 uh, log 2 sorry this approach is log 2 multiply with 3 divide with 3 this approach is log 3 right so basically we have factorized this exponential part, part in terms of three factors 2 to the power x minus 1 2 to the power 2x minus 1 2 to the power 3x minus 1 now this will approach to a, a, a finite value if we have x cube in denominator 
so so an x how we get x cube in denominator this is again an indeterminate form so we divide with x and this approach is 1 we divide this we rationalize this and divide with this with x square so this approach is minus half right so finally the answer is this limiting value is this